Alright guys, so in today's Arsenal video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to get filthy rich in Roblox Arsenal, which you need that good stuff called money to get stuff like character cases, melee cases, and even items in the daily shop like shrink and scubus. If you don't got money, you don't got those items, and you suck, so you need money to get those items. So in today's video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to get that filthy rich money right into your pockets. And if you do enjoy this video and you want to be rich forever, then make sure to subscribe and drop a like on this video now i won't lie that's actually not going to do anything but just make me happy but please do it anyways all right so before we get started with this video i have something that might interest you guys so i get comments from you guys all the time asking me for tips and tricks on how to get started with their own youtube channel and the main tip that i usually give is to learn how to edit your videos properly and now with Famora 10 video editing is easier than ever and you have nothing to be afraid of Femora 10 is a powerful user-friendly video editing software from Wondershare and it's perfect for beginners. I wish I had this when I started editing my videos. The interface is super simple and user-friendly and there's tons of preset templates like text, filters, overlays, and animated stickers that can help you create fun and engaging videos and projects. And you can easily create a video in as little as 10 minutes. And also, now with the recently launched Filmora 10.4, editing is even easier. The new Poly Entrance Start page helps you start your project with the tools that you need to make it into a polished and professional masterpiece. Filmora 10.4 also comes with a volume normalization feature that helps your audio flow perfectly through the whole project. So if you're interested in getting started with Filmora, check the description below and also the pinned comment, and there'll be a link to get started with a free Filmora trial. Now the trial version does have a watermark, but you can still try all of the features for free. If you do decide to try Femora, then comment down below hashtag bandnightsxfemora and let me know what kind of content you'll be making with Femora. And also a huge thanks to Wondershare for sponsoring this video. Now let's get back into the video. Alright, so the main things you want to do to get rich in arsenals, get kills, get wins, and also do these things called contracts. Of course, my first contract is get 100 kills. As you see, if I get 100 kills, I get 300 bucks. Now, this one kind of sucks, but we have monthly contracts where you could just get kills and do some pretty easy things. So, first off, we're going to get 10 kills for this monthly contract and just work up the 100 kill one over time of playing a couple games. Now, the thing is, if they say kills, you need kills. You can't get assists. You can't let your teammates do the work for you. You gotta be good enough to get those kills yourself and learn how to shoot people in their face, okay? And don't get killed by Allison Laba. The first monthly thing that we have is just 10 kills. Pretty simple. The other one's 100, which I don't know why they would do that to me. I, I'm a nice person and they want me to get 100 kills for 300 bucks. That's a scam, but I'll still do it. I need money. Hey, come here, stupid. What are you doing? There we go. There's our first contract. Look at that. 350 bucks for 10 kills. Don't know why the monthly contract has 100, but okay. If they're just kill ones, you're just going to be playing Arsenal and you're literally just going to get these things. But there are some other ones that you actually have to do more objective-based things with, so uh, we're going to do those in a second. But let's just finish off this game with our... Thank you. Alright, thank you for your contributions, people. So, I mean, 100 kills isn't really too bad. It's like 5 games as long as you get at least 20 kills. Again, not assists, at least 20 actual nice kills however i can usually get near 30. let's see how much money we racked up in that first game with our contract our kills and our first dub all right so we got 440 bucks that's a pretty good start not as much as i thought but that's okay because we still have more things to do so this one will give us another 300 but we do have some new things here. So we have heavy weapon kills, we have survivor kills, and we have rounds played. So we got to play three games. Survivor kills should be pretty easy too, as long as we take some damage and then just survive it and kill people while we're damaged. That's how you get survivor kills. So that should be simple enough. Here, shoot me. Shoot me. How are you burning that bad and you're not dead? Okay, whatever. I will survive. I will survive. Ow. Ow. Oh, there we go. That's a survivor kill. This map's kind of better to do it on because there's walls. I usually don't like agency, but for this one, it's not bad because I can actually hide. <laughs> also, the monthly contracts, I think as they go up, you get more from them. So that first one was pretty easy. We didn't get too much, but as the contracts go up, they get to be more and more. And they make you do more too. So expect to do chores for roll pretty much. Ow. Another survivor kill there. That's me dying. Guys, can you just shoot me once, but don't like kill me with the shotgun or something? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what? The, what? Is that Naruto?
Hey, don't do that. Ooh. Ooh, that's a lot of survivor kills right there. Look at that. Five health. I just killed a lot of people. That's a survivor kill. That's a survivor kill. Let's go. Let's go. Let's snipe this guy who doesn't know that I'm behind him. Let's go. Boom. Oh, that is... Okay, we're gonna menu real quick and oh, that's worse. That's bad. Okay. All right So we're just need one more survivor kill and uh, that'll be some more money. We got one more round played to be done All right, there we go and we got the rounds challenge which is another 350 bucks so now we got to get one more survivor kill, and I think this round should hopefully get us to that daily challenge. Never mind. All right, I need to just get kills though and not really assist because I got to get that daily challenge completed. I like that it is here. There we go. Survivor challenge killed thingy mabobber. 350 bucks. What am I hearing? It's scary. Kabloop. Kabloop. Come here. Come here. What? Okay, well that works. So more survivor kills, seven this time. And the rounds played. Now the cool thing is too, if you want some extra starting cash, you can type POG in this. That gives you 1200 bucks. So now we're at 2500. So now we're really filling the money and we got Microsoft Word 1234 hacking. I got Lil Nas in first place. Come on, give me those survivor kills. Is that survivor kills? I think so. There we go. Free fire the heck out of this door because they're all running through. Burn them all on fire. Get like 20 kills in a row. There we go. There we go. Look at that. Call me a cheater or something. Say I'm hacking. Say that I'm really, I'm really bad and I'm cheating. Say that I suck at Roblox. Come here. There's no one back here. Come here. We're really taking over, dude. I can't vote now because the game is broken. And more stuff completed in here. We got the daily challenge done. We got three more survivor kills. That'll be some more money. And then we got one more win. And uh, let's see how much we get. Let's spawn in. There should be a challenge that's like, don't die in a game, and then you get like, a billion dollars. It's actually pretty hard to not die in this game, because usually you always are just gonna get pooped on. Kaboom. All right, look at that. So we're almost level 12 too. So I think leveling up gives you some extra money. But there we go. We got some stuff completed. If we play three more games, we'll get some more. So in the end though, after playing for only like 15 minutes, I think to 20 minutes, we've made 3.3K. That was about 20 minutes. So in an hour, that would be 9.9K, almost 10,000 bucks in just an hour of playing. So let's just round that up to 10,000. And if you were to play for a full day of 24 hours, that's 240,000 bucks. You're rich. You could buy literally like all this stuff, all this stuff. So pretty much all you gotta do is just keep up on the contracts but there you go that's how you can make some good money in arsenal follow through with this and you can have a million bucks and probably like like a week if you just know life but anyways hope you guys did enjoy this video and if you did make sure to go ahead and drop a like on it and subscribe for some more videos like this and i'll see you guys in the next video so goodbye